Hello guys, Gaming Lime here, and welcome your faces and fingers back to another episode of Better Than Finger on FM18. This is episode number 71, and in today's episode we will be facing Tottenham in the Premier League and Real Madrid in the group stage of the Champions League. Since you were last here, we have had a very narrow win against Chelsea. Arthur's deflected free kick in the 26th minute was the only goal at Stamford Bridge um, we was a little bit lucky to 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 win that game to keep hold of that game and um, then we faced Burnley in the Carabao Cup and we beat them 3-0 so our undefeated streak so far is I think at 41 games or 42 games I can't quite remember um, Manchester United lost against Manchester City earlier on in today's schedule so this would be a very very big win if we can manage to beat Tottenham here Tottenham have had a surge up the table and they start the game in third place only uh, four points behind us actually which is very very close and De Vrij and Leno have got to deal with this here and they do. Here's Bellerin, Arthur, Rag, Meyer. Back to Rag. Here's Jelson Martins. We need someone to have a very good game here today and 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 control this game. Martial, that's a good ball. And Max Meyer, he's been in goal scoring form at this moment. He has scored. I think he scored what well, he scored two against Madrid the game that you guys saw in the last episode he scored two against Burnley in the Carabao Cup as well and he's just scored an excellent an excellent finish as well great movement great passing 1-0 up inside 5 minutes and that is a decent start to this game hopefully we can continue and and play well and and just keep Tottenham away we are on a very, very good streak, and I don't want it to, to finish. Esteban, Rag, oh, and that was, could, could, I can't remember his name. What is it? Catrone, Catrone. I'm sure it's Patrick Catrone, because he's Italian, and it sounds a little bit Italian. Patrick Catrone, I think that's how you say it. If, him, if I'm wrong, let me know in the comment section below. Just, just tell me, and... I'll correct myself. 22 minutes gone. We've had five shots, two on target, one in the back of the net. Tottenham have yet to have a shot. Um, if we do win this game, like we are at this moment in time, we will be on the same uh, played games as Manchester United and four points ahead of them, seven points ahead of Tottenham. Same point or same goals, uh, same games played. Um, but our goal difference is 26 and Manchester United is 12. Uh, Caton has got a injury here. He will be coming off at half time. We are a few minutes away from half time. Uh, Lacazette will come on. A couple of minutes of injury time here to be added on. He's suffered a bruised ankle. Max Meyer as well injured with a bruised knee. Um, we will go to our tactic board. And we will make the change. Catone, Catone off, Lacazette on. We will do a team talk and say keep going. Doesn't do anything. Max Meyer may have to come off as well, but we got Torreira on the bench. In fact, he's not actually moving. He's come out here and Arthur's been taken out here. I think that was just a little bit of a glitch there. Arthur with the free kick whips it in. And it is cleared and Lacazette will pick it up and get dispossessed. But that is the end of the highlight, which is good news for us because that means Tottenham won't attack. They have had one shot now. We've had 13 shots. Um, now they've had two now. Uh, but we'll see what happens. We're 52 minutes in to this game already. Um, I am looking at Max Meyer and he may have to come off. Um, but we'll bring Richard on. Oh, Martial's now picked up an injury. Hmm, this could be interesting. Martial may need to come off more than Ma um, Mayer. 
I'm going to make... Oh, wait now. No, it's our free kick. Mayer's there. Arthur picks up the ball. Plays in Mayer. Lacazette, it goes down. Alexander Lacazette will take the penalty. I don't know how many goals he scored this season. It's not many. But Lacazette's got a big chance to give us a two-goal lead. And it's saved by the goalkeeper. Oh, why is Lacazette taking that penalty? I don't think Lacazette should be taking the penalty. All right, let's make their changes. I think we've got to do Diamari Gray for Martial and Richard for Mayer. I think that's got to be the two injured players coming off with 15 minutes to go. Arthur with a free kick. Oh, he's normally better than that as well. We are only 1-0 up. I think we're going to go to defensive. Oh, maybe not. They're going to score here, aren't they? Here's Eric Dyer. Look at the space he's got there. Kieran Tierney. Richard intercepts. Kieran Tierney to Martins. He finds Bellerin. Bellerin to Rag. Back to Martins. He switches the play to Tierney. Gray. Richard. Martins. Lacazette back to Richard. We're keeping the ball very, very nicely here. And here's Bellerin. There it is. 2 0 up. 10 minutes to go. We will make that change and go defensive and go structured. We want the three points. It's well played here. We kept the ball very, very nicely. Martins slips in Bellerin. It wasn't the best finish, but he's right back, so we'll, we'll let him off for that finish. We will make it 42 games, I've just seen. 42 games without losing. This run stretches back till last season. Um, Harry Winks, is, and that's cleared off the line by Kieran Tierney. Uh, 49 was Arsenal's real-life record. 49 games, we are 42 games. So we are pretty close to that. Um, probably in the next episode, I will try and show you that. Um, if we get there because I want to skip forward a few games now we've played you guys have seen a couple in the, in the last week or so or last last episode you saw, only saw like a week s space in real in in game so um, we didn't really progress too far but there you go we do beat Tottenham um, could have been more to be honest look at that 23 shots 10 on target penalty miss from Lacazette but we get an early goal in the 6th minute and a late goal in the 80th minute to win the game 2-0. And I will see you guys for the Real Madrid game. Okay, boys, here we go for the Real Madrid game. Um, no real changes, we'll just get straight into it. So I apologise for um, if you hear my cat running around because he's decided to start running around outside. Um, so you might hear some crazy footsteps going on or you might hear him crying because he's shut out of the office at the moment and he doesn't like being shut out so if you hear that I do apologize um, we're facing Real Madrid again Oof, we're almost, it's almost 1-0 up inside 20 seconds um, I think if we win this we're not 100% guaranteed to qualify um, for the knockout stages, but we are pretty close, I think. Um, I was just looking at our Premier League form, and we are only one, two, three, four, five, six, seven games away, or seven, seven Premier League games away from beating Arsenal's uh, 49 game unbeaten streak in the league. Um, this stretches back to last season as well where we went I think it was what was it 33 games last season it's been 10 this season so far um, so we are looking that's that is in sight and to be honest I think we might be able to do it we've got Leicester Leeds Stoke Manchester United, Bournemouth, Newcastle, Reading. So, oh, Dybal has just scored an excellent goal. I think Leno should be saving this. Cristiano Ronaldo sets him up. 
Asensio back out to Ronaldo. Ronaldo whips in across. And Dybala on the half volley. Ooh, I think Leno should be saving that. Um, so yeah, going back to those that list of uh, teams. We should be winning those games. Like We definitely shouldn't be losing. Leicester are bottom. Leicester, uh, Leeds are pretty close to the bottom. Stoke, I don't know where they are. They're probably mid-table. Manchester United are probably the only team in that that m might beat us. I know we've had struggles with Bournemouth as well. Um, but the run we're on and the form we're in, we should be winning. Jelson Martins has just equalised here. Um, as I say, I'm not really too fussed about this game against Real Madrid because um, we did beat them in the first game, so we have got that advantage over them, and I'm 90% sure that we can beat uh, Leipzig and Besiktas in our last two games, so we should be fine, we should qualify no matter what happens here against Real Madrid. Um, it's nice to stay undefeated though but remember last season we went through um the whole group stage of the champions league without being beaten as well and um, we absolutely got stuffed in the what was it the semi-finals or the quarterfinals i can't quite remember the semi-finals against uh, psg so just because we have a good run in the group stage uh doesn't really mean anything we've had tough first round knockouts for the past what three seasons I think I can't remember who we had in our first season back when we won it um, but we've had Bayern Munich in the past two seasons in a row so um, I'm hoping that if even if we do win the the group we don't get Bayern again um, I'm hoping for not an easy run because you never get an easy run in the Champions League I don't think um, but A nicer tie, like not a Bayern Munich, not a Barcelona or any anybody like that. Um, I know it's difficult because you can only play a second seeded team if you win your group and you can't play um, other English teams either. So you are like kind of restricted. Dybala's done well, Bale's hit the crossbar and Arthur has cleaned out for a corner. I don't think we're doing that well today, to be honest. Um, I think Real Madrid have had the better of the chances uh, they did take the lead through Dybala, but we have equalised. It's coming up to half time here. If we can go in 1 1 at half time, I'd be fairly happy. Martial now might counter attack. It's Rag. It's back to Martial. Oh, we didn't get to see that. Martial is actually slightly injured, so I might have to take him off at half time. Uh, here is Asensio. He switches it out to Ronaldo. Into Dybala. Bale. He whips in across, and that's good defending, but it's come back out. Almost Ronaldo, Bernardo, Tony Cruz, and Arthur's intercepted there. And now we might counter-attack here. It's Jelson Martins. He whip in across. It's Lacazette. It's a good save by Donnarumma, but Lacazette has put in the, the rebound. They're saying it's a defensive mistake here because of... He missed his chance to... The centre-back missed his chance to clear his lines. I don't think he did there. I don't think... He's in the wrong position, but I don't think he missed his chance. But anyway, Lacazette has scored to make it 2-1 right before half-time. Um, so I think we will make that change at half-time. Anthony Martial uh, doesn't look too pleased. Oops, I missed it. Let's go to tactics. Uh, 6.6 he's not doing great um, that's Gray or Richard Gray or Richard let's put in Damari Gray <coughs> oh, excuse me I didn't mean to do that on on, on uh, microphone anyway 2-1 um, going into the second half Anthony Martial will go off um, I forgot to do it Bernardo it's a miss hit that that's a bad strike here comes the Amari Gray. Give him a run around, see what he does. The lit, we are. <laughs> the Amari Gray has just scored. There you go. That's a nice way to um, start your Champions League. I think this is the first game he's played in the Champions League ever in his career. Um, 
but he's put us 3-1 up. So yeah, we're still going here. Oh, I've given away here. Lacazette. Martins gets dispossessed. Donnarama plays it up to Asensio. He loses the ball. Lacazette loses the ball. It's a little bit... Here comes Martins. Rag, what a finish that is. The cross comes in. It's cleared away, but only as far as Esteban Rag. And he slots it in that bottom corner. Joseph Martins does really well here. He finds Bellerin. Bellerin whips it in. I know it's Martins that whips it in. It's cleared and rag. Oh, it wasn't bottom corner. It was absolutely smashed into that top corner. What a goal. What a goal. And we are 4-1 up against Real Madrid. It's, just, it's crazy. Here's Arthur. Delit. Arthur again. Rag. Mayer. Back to Rag. Can he find Martins? Yes, he can. Martins to Arthur. We're keeping the ball so well here. Martins again. Mayer, what a ball that is. Bellerin. Ah, oh, that is a fantastic team goal. That's absolutely magnificent. To do that against Real Madrid is crazy. Look at these passing. Look at this ball here by Mayer to Bellerin. He squares it and Lacazette just taps it in for 5-1. 52 minutes gone and we are 5-1 up away from home at the Bernabeu. Not the Bernabeu. That's where that's where Barcelona play. What am I talking about? Where do Real Madrid play? Why can't I think this? Um, it is the Bernabeu, isn't it? Yeah, the Bernabeu. The new camp is where Barcelona play. What am I thinking of? Wow. What a stupid thing to say. Bellerin again. Lacazette, almost a hat trick. Can they cause a counter attack here? That's good defending. I'm going to make a couple of changes. Not yet, I'll leave it five minutes. I've only got two changes left because we brought Gray on. Um, I don't know who to change in. Diorara. What a challenge by De Litt there. Here's Lacazette. That's a good ball. Martins, there's nobody really in the box and it's easily dealt with by the defenders. Here's Kieran Tierney on the halfway line. Rag, looking for Martins but can't quite find him. This is good passing around by Barcelona. They found Dybala. It's Carvajal, Bale, Asensio. Kieran Tierney, but it falls back to Bale. Bale whips it in and Ronaldo hits the crossbar and Gareth Bale scores to make it 5-2 um, I want to bring uh, Benavidez on just to give him some time we'll take off Delit. Uh this kid is supposed to be absolutely phenomenal um, we'll bring on whoops, we'll bring on Richard as well for Mayer and confirm that we're 5-2 up um, I don't want to see this game goal even. Seven goals in this game already. It's crazy. Five of them from us. Here's Richard. Jelson Martins. Esteban Rag finds Lacazette. And that's a good save by Donnarama. Denying Lacazette his hat-trick. Um, I think he's going to get his hat-trick. I think we're going to win. We're going to win like 6-2. Carver Howe's going to be sent off here, is he? No. Is a free kick. Rag, De Vrij. Oh, Benavidias. Ben, ben Benavidias, I think that's how you say his name. I'm not really sure, but he's an excellent young player. And I, I want to be playing him a little bit more than he is at the moment. Here's Gray. Rag, Richard. He's just coming back from injury, of course. Here's Bellerin. Can't quite get his cross in. It's Arthur. Rag. Martins does really well. And oh, he's put it straight at Donnarama there. I think he should be he pulling that back. Richard, Lacazette on the halfway line. Finds Rag, who finds Richard. And oh, he can't score. We've had so many chances. 20 shots. 14 of them have been on target. That's That's crazy. Crazy numbers. Absolutely ridiculous. 
Is there another chance here? Are we going to score even more goals? Or are Real Madrid going to get one back? Here's Bale, tried to switch the play to Ronaldo. Diorara, Asensio, Dybala. Good defending. And we're on again. Counter-attacks on. Can Diamari Gray get there? Not quite, not quite, not quite. It's Bale, Asensio, that's a good ball. Dybala gets another one back. 5-3 now. This is crazy. This is bad defending, though, I think. Bale here, plays it into Asensio. This ball here is a decent one, and Dybala does well. I think that's the youngster that I just brought on as well that I was bigging him up. Number 20, Hester Diab, what is it? Benavidez, 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 yeah, whatever. I think it was him making the mistake there. It's not really a mistake, he's just caught wrong side of Dybala, and he's done well to chest that down. Here's Richard Lacazette. He's still on a hat-trick, remember. So is Dybala now, actually, as well. It's a race for a hat-trick. Dybala intercepts Kieran Tierney, and now Gareth Bale can come away with the ball. Cruz, Ronaldo. It's Dybala again. Difficult angle, but he's hit the post. They've hit the crossbar three, uh, twice and the post now. Here's Tony Cruz with a load of space on the edge of the box. Finds Asensio, finds Ronaldo, and it's going to be a free kick to us last 10 minutes here do we I think we keep going <clears throat> excuse me I'm, my voice is running out losing my voice here's Bellerin Richard Jelson Martins <coughs> excuse me rag can't find yes he can here's Diamari Gray is it Jelson Martins at the back post and what a save by Donnarama it will be a corner Last eight minutes here. Arthur gives the ball away. Dybala here on the halfway line is all on his own. They are coming forward here. It is Diorara. And Leno makes a very, very easy save. Richard has just hit an absolute rocket that has smashed off Asensio and gone in to the back of the net and it is 6-3 what a game here here's Arthur what a finish that is oh my god he spun and hit that can we see that again this is oh, there's still more goals in this or more chances what a ball it's been a very very open game we have conceded three goals but we've scored six Richard falling to Bellerin why is Bellerin so far up this is he drives me crazy it's going to be, I don't know what that was. They were fighting over the ball. Tony Cruz, Diorara. And now it's cleared up to Gareth Bale. What? Richard's goal was absolutely phenomenal, by the way. I know it deflected, but his technique, he like spun and hit it on the volley on the edge of the box. It was, it was a crazy goal. That's probably the best goal I've seen us score. In a long time. I can't think of a better goal than that. I know it's deflected. And I know it's gone down as an own goal. But. It was ridiculous. This episode is going to be so long. Because there's so many highlights. It's crazy. 6-3. We are 10 seconds away from the full time whistle. I know our defence haven't been great. But we are playing Real Madrid. And our attack has been phenomenal. Crazy game. It was only 1-1 at half time, wasn't it? I can't even remember. I want to see this goal again. Uh, can we... How do I do it as a... Oh, I don't remember. Um, anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. If you did enjoy it, please leave it a big thumbs up. Also... Um, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel and I will see you guys next time.